Have a look at this structure. What does it look like? Some might say it's a namespace package, while others argue it's a regular package. We've got two terms here, namespace package and regular package. Let's break them down and figure out how packaging works in Python. Let's get back to this structure. This part here is considered a namespace package, while this part here is a regular package. If a directory contains this little file, Python treats it as a regular package. On the other hand, if you have sub-packages and modules spread across multiple directories, and those directories don't have a dunder in it, Python treats it as a namespace package. But how does Python decide that? Let's say we're trying to import something called sample. When Python tries to import it, here's what happens step by step. First, Python starts checking each folder in the parent path. Now, if it finds a folder named sample that has an init file, Python says, ah, this is a regular package. It imports it and stops looking further. But if this isn't the case, Python looks for a file named sample.py. If it finds it, Python says, oh, this is a module. It imports it and stops looking further. Now, if neither of those is found, but Python does see a folder named sample without an init file, it doesn't immediately know what to do. It says, let me note it down and keep checking other folders. And finally, if Python finishes looking through all the folders and doesn't find a regular package or a module, but it did find one or more sample folders without an init file, it says, all right, let's combine these folders and create a namespace package. Let's see what this looks like in action. I have two directories, both named product, and neither of them contains an init file. Python will treat them as part of the same namespace package. So if I import product, Python will combine the paths of both product directories into one namespace. But now, if I add an init file here, things change. Python will no longer see product as a namespace package. Instead, it becomes a regular package and Python will only use the first product directory it finds. The second one, it gets completely ignored. And that's how packaging works in Python. Simple, right? Thanks for watching. If you liked it, give a thumbs up and subscribe to 2 Minutes Pi for more Python goodness.